Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, it's just gonna be something fun. We're out here in Denver at the Gem and Mineral Rock Shop show, and this is just gonna be fun. I'm just gonna show you around of how all the amazing crystals, fossils, stones, and all that other stuff. I can't even talk right now properly because I'm so excited to be here. So hopefully I don't go overboard with how much I am going to get. So we shall see, take you along. So, so far, this place is amazing, but we are getting ready to hit the big boys. The big boys. The ones that make you just go, mm. <laughs> Okay, you rolled on it too. You know you need to. <laughs> So it is literally so hard to choose from. There's so many vendors with such amazing stones. Man, we're just now getting started too. So let's see how this goes. Can we keep our composure with these stones?
Yeah, hold on. like a big old diamond, yeah. Inclusion courts? Okay, so we did everything on the inside. Now it's time to check out the outside. And then we're gonna go get some food and that's probably gonna be it for the rest of the vlog. Whew. All right, so we are back home after a long ride. We are all tired. Um, I decided not to film the rest of the day. You know, I got tired of filming and you know, just wanted to spend time just being present there, um, but it, I believe this happens every year, so it is worth it to go out there. And we didn't even get to experience the whole thing, apparently. But just that little bit that we got to experience was like, holy cow. But I'm going to show you guys one of the stones that I got. I got this selenite slab here. Decent price. And this thing is going to go on the new altar for Aaron and I's um, altar. So speaking of, here she is. All right, so since you weren't part of the vlog much, can you tell us your experience? Uh, I was lost in the crystals. I was just having fun like a little kid, like, ooh, ah, ooh. Um, it was a little overwhelming. Definitely, <laughs> definitely. Um, there was a lot to look at. There was, there was a lot of repetition, so there, there was like moments where I'm like, ah, I just want to see some rare ones. So that was one thing that I'm like, where, where are all the rare ones? But we only went to like a couple sections. I feel like we only experienced a third. Yeah. Like. Yeah, but it was a lot. Um, like even the most common ones, like the Amethyst Cathedrals and. Um, the Rose Quartz. The Rose Quartz, you know, you, we got to see like major ones of those, which was, Big you know, ones. amazing. But those I agree. Were beautiful. Yeah. yeah, exactly. I agree. Like we were looking for those rare ones that you don't yeah, just, see. Yeah, like, the ones that you thing. don't see very often yep. at every metaphysical store, you know. Um, overall, though, I would say it was super fun. Um, I mean, I just was a little kid giddy the entire time, you know. Um, I caught myself going like, oh, a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Especially the big pieces. I was just like, oh, can I take you home? 
<laughs> yeah, there was this one part where, and it wasn't even a stone that got me like that. It was a hand pan and a hand mm -hmm. drum, basically, mm -hmm. that got me like, oh my God, I was just out of days. I was in the flow. And don't get me wrong, I love the crystals there, but that stole the show for me. And I'm excited to see them for a decent price. Yeah. Man. I mean, I also, the entire time, was like, ooh, because my next day off is like Saturday, so... In my head, I'm like, okay, what crystals am I gonna go get? Because that's why I will go back <laughs> on Saturday um, and just get a select few. Yeah, and sadly, it is not my day off, so I'm gonna be sending her money to go get some of the songs that I saw. You know, I already showed you guys the, the slab here that I'm mm. excited to use, but man, there is more definitely that I saw. Yeah, I was trying just like to be very consciously aware of not just like overconsumption. Like, I was trying to actually, like, what crystals do I need? What stones do I need? And, like, so, yeah, I'm very proud of myself that I didn't, like, buy anything, like. Like, compulsive like buy, man. compulsive <laughs> buying, because I usually do that. And especially with crystals, I do have. Most definitely. I do citrine. have a lot of crystals already. And it's, like, I want to, <laughs> like, I want to figure out, like, what I really want to do with crystals and, like, how I want to, like, you know, do all the things. But I'm very proud of myself. Very proud of myself. Yeah, definitely. But I also think it has to do with the fact that there wasn't really as much rare different stones either. That's true. Because all the stones you do have, you already have. Just bigger versions of it and more unique shapes. Yeah. Other than that, that, it's like... That's true. Except for the citrine. The citrine was all over the place, this, man. And uh, it was constant. Like, oh my God. And there's some beautiful, like, raw, beautiful citrine. You guys, citrine all over the place. is like one of my favorites. Definitely. One of my favorites of all time. <laughs> yeah. But... Yeah, guys, whenever you guys get a chance, this happens every year, right? Yeah, every year. Um, I want to say September every single year in Colorado. Mm -hmm. um, so it's one of the major gym shows in the United States. Yep. Um, it is large, but it is smaller than like the Tucson one. Um, but I want to say Tucson and Colorado are one of the main known gym mineral shows. Yeah. I'm sure there's like um, some in California and some on the East Coast, but I know those two are like some big, big... Mm -hmm. convention one so and i i mean it was huge it was it was, yeah. a lot. it was a lot and sadly like i mentioned we didn't get to experience it. we just experienced like a third of it but yeah. still it was worth it it was well fulfilling it was so you fun know? so yeah but yeah guys um if you ever get a chance to come out to denver and just go visit it around this time next year and it's it's well worth it decent prices mm. on majority of the stones you know great vendors feel the energy of course everywhere there's going to be some highs and some lows because people only worry about the money compared to like the metaphysical of the things and stuff like that but you get that everywhere so you take that how you want but other than that we shall see you guys on the next video don't forget to leave a like subscribe mm -hmm. and share this video to all your friends and family that are interested in crystals and stones and spiritual stuff that is coming into this channel mm -hmm. so you guys see you soon